best entertainment on the earth. Tune in for Comics with Perch. Hey everybody, this is Perch. How long does it take to be successful? This is the uh, crux of a mail that I've got here. Let me read it to you and then we can talk about it. It says, hey Perch, the question stems from your discussion with Joe about Jace Fox and why this character is failing. Is the industry as it is not able to incubate interesting characters that people care about? Do the executives want immediate hit after hit without the requisite patience? How can a new character have enough breathing room to develop and become interesting? I can see perhaps Strange Academy as an incubator for a bunch of potential franchise characters, but needs to exist by itself for many years. Introducing a character and then throwing them into their own series after such a short period of time feels really forced, and trying to hit a home run in the every at bat instead of going through years of development the minor leagues with an occasional call up to the majors before actually getting a real shot at the majors. It's April, so there's my timely baseball analogy. Hey, thank you. I hate baseball, by the way. Uh, the, there's no greater hell, hell to me than having to go to a baseball game unless I can get super drunk. And uh, I, I've gone to baseball games, and uh, the only good part is beer. I, I swear to God, that game moves at a pace that is agonizing to me. I, I'm, I'm, you know, I, I don't like football in the sense that, like, I, what I want to see is every play with none of of the moments between the stop of play and the start of the next play. Like, I, I can't take it. I, I remain convinced that there's a uh, powerful service out there that if you could say, hey, we'll give you the football games and we'll cut out everything that is not play. I, I, first of all, those games would be like a half an hour, and they would be amazing. I would be all over that. So anyway, um, but, but baseball, it's an American pastime right now. This is me revealing I'm a commie, I guess. Anyway, um, to the topic at hand. Um, look, there's a definite impatience within comics to actually incubate characters. And what's weird about this is that there's plenty of evidence and proof that you need to have patience to get things to where they want to go. If you don't let things play out, if you don't properly build characters, if you don't let things evolve at a natural pace to get attention then it doesn't, it doesn't work. I'll, I'll put it to you this way. Um, Miles Morales took a while to get to where he was. The only reason he was successful, and in many cases it was successful in spite of Marvel's best efforts, is because the character idea was relatively strong. It was the idea of a kid uh, who has vaguely spider powers, is kind of learning his way, and, and kind of you know through mishap and everything else, add a little bit of kind of cool aspect to it. That's Miles Morales, and it just needed some time to incubate. And Marvel gave it time, far more time than it's given other characters, but it still doesn't really work. I recently read uh, Spider-Punk by Marvel, and that is an awful comic. I mean, just on all fronts, uh, there, that, is, that is a dismal pile of shit. And the, the, they, they throw in... I mean, like it's it's like there's a joke on every page. So you got um, you got Spider Punk, and then you have Captain uh, what is it? Captain uh, Anarchy, uh, Captain America, and uh, he's gay. And then you've got uh, Riri Williams Ironheart, and Ironheart's all dressed up like a punk version of Iron Man. And you read this thing, and it's like it's a colossal mess. And it again goes to this a uh, weird belief that people at Marvel have that Ironheart is actually a character that people give a shit about, which they don't. I, I now, That doesn't mean that, they, that people couldn't. There is a world where you have a you know, black teen uh, female character, and you, she's uh, kind of you know, into herself, kind of tech you know, genius, and there's a world where that becomes a very interesting character. But you can't get there in like four comics. And I was surprised by this. Somebody, somebody recently mentioned to me, like, do you realize how quick Bendis tried to get Riri Williams over within four comics? They were trying to convince you that she was the leading star of the series and worthy of the successor to Iron Man. That's like four. That's like less like counting on one hand four. Like there, there's just no way. I mean, I complained about One Piece. Like, do you remember if you, if you're reading One Piece right now, 
And uh, you, the introduction of Chopper, who is the ship's doctor. He's a member of the crew, but he's not a main character. I mean, he's, well, he's sort of main. He's, I would call him a sub main character. And I'll be damned if they didn't spend like 60 chapters building that character before he even joined the crew. Um, Brock was similar. Uh, Frankie. I mean, Frankie had to be like well over a hundred chapters to get him to the point where he, he would join the crew as a supporting character. I mean, that, that's, that, that you, that's what manga is doing. I, I don't know what, you know, like who is high at Marvel to think that in four comics, you can convince everybody that Ruby Williams is, is successful. It's madness. You have to have patience for this stuff. And, I mean, look, again, the, the, it, this isn't even a debatable point. You look at the facts of comics and how things have worked over the years and everything else, and ca characters took a long time to get to where they are. I, look, the, the previous uh, black male character, uh, you know, <laughs> Rhodey, James Rhodes, uh, becoming War Machine, that, that was a long burn before we put him inside the costume. And as a result, people actually care about the character. They care about that journey. If you don't give people time, if you don't build up this stuff, you never get anywhere. And there's, a, there's an impatience in comics right now that is madness. What's weird about this is the customers are begging for this stuff to, to decompress a little bit, to take longer. You know, just build a character up. People are willing to pay you for that to happen. I mean, imagine, if you will, both at DC and Marvel, how much more success a lot of these new characters would have if they just took their time. And by took their time, I mean just introduce the character slowly, not as a backup story, just have the character hanging around, doing stuff, learning the ropes, and then you know, eventually can take over the, the mantle of whatever it happens to be. The complaint around John Kent getting aged up is that they fast forwarded a big part of the character's development that fans and customers actually wanted to see. But more importantly, and please let this point sink in, it's not just that they wanted to see it. They wanted to pay for it. So, I, look, let me be as direct as possible. You fucking idiots, let the customers give you money to do this the right way. Why in the hell are you trying to hit the fast forward button to get, you know, to say, I, I don't want to spend the time building this character up. I just want to get to the finish line as fast as possible. It doesn't work. But more importantly, don't you realize that you could milk your customer base for years out of $3.99, $4.99 comics? Like, it, it take, like, reverse action for a minute. What if Riri Williams had been built up inside of Iron Man for five years? I know, that sounds like, a, like, like oh my God, it sounds, oh my God, so long. The, the entire Earth and the, envir the environment will be destroyed in five years. I, I can't wait that long. Yeah, but you can. Five years build up Riri Williams. Five years. At $4 a pop times 12. Do, do, you, do you realize how much money you would make off of customers watching them explore the journey of Riri Williams as a character? I mean, people are would buy into that. They would pay for that. They would pay you to develop the character. How great is that? So, I mean, to, to, to the, the point of the mail, like, look, Jace Fox... Hey, I know you want to put out a comic book saying, I am Batman. I am, look, hey, black people, there's a black guy inside the Batman suit. Black people, so you, you are now Batman. We, are, we listen to you and care about you. God damn, that seems racist to me. I'm sorry. Most black people actually want to read something entertaining that doesn't insult their intelligence. I don't think they want to have a comic book thrust at them to say, Hey, you're black. This character is black. Look, black. Give us money. How terrible. It's terrible. To me, that's racism. Take time to actually build up this character. Do you realize, like, like Batwing, 
was developed over a, over a pretty long course of action. Let's say you do a storyline. It'd be, God, it'd be so easy to do. Bruce Wayne Batman's like, hey, I'm, uh, I'm getting tired. These battles are taking more and more out of me. One of these days, Joker is going to act, you know, I'm, I'm going to screw up and Joker is going to kill me. And I have no legacy. No, I have a little bit of legacy. I've got Damien out there. My son's doing stuff. And I've got, you know, uh, you know, Tim out there. And I've got Nightwing. And I've got Barbara. There's lots of people in the Bat family. Kate is out doing stuff. I've got lots of things. But there's so much villainy. I need more. I need more legacy. Jace Fox, you care about people. Here, let's, let's work together to build you up as a Batman character. Because one day you could be Batman. So let's, uh, let's have you go on an amount, amazing amount of ventures. Let me build you up as this character. Take years to do that. The, the, the crazy part is fans will eat that up. They'll, they'll happily fork over $3.99, $4.99 a month to watch you build up this character. That's the path. That is the way, as they say in The Mandalorian. That is the way. The alternative to that is to say, hey, look, Batman's black now. And if you don't like it, you're a racist. That, we, we have enough evidence to, to prove that does not work at all. So take your time. Build up these characters. Let them be something. That's what the fans are begging for. And when I say the fans are begging for it, the fans are begging for it and wanting to pay you for it. I gotta stress that enough. The fans, I, God, imagine how a lot of the indies feel that are just trying to get any kind of attention into the book. Meanwhile, Marvel and DC, you've got fans who are willing to fork over cash for three, four, five years to watch you build up these characters. They are willing to pay you to do the character development. Take advantage of it. Don't 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 sleep on this. It it makes it kind of makes me crazy. Anyway, good mail. Thank you. Yes, please take your time, dumbasses. God. Anyway, thanks for listening. 